we must confront the reality. The fact that achieving the Paris climate goals means emissions need to fall drastically across all sectors, including industries such as steelmaking. And with roughly three quarters of our underlying earnings derived from the sale of iron ore, this means a large degree of our business and customer base is structurally challenged unless it works to decarbonise its operations. To be afforded such a rare opportunity to foresee and mitigate such a substantial threat to this company's prospects and not act is a failure of leadership that exposes the capital invested in this company to needless risk. We won't know if our efforts to, for instance, the partnerships that we've gone into and the efforts that we've undertaken to work with our clients are the right efforts with the right level of ambition if we don't frame them by setting targets around them. And we can't hold this inconsistency sustainably as a company where, we, where the position of the, the, the board appears to be that these aren't emission reductions within our control, yet we can work with our customers and clients to reduce emissions. I think that needs to be resolved, and the only one putting forward a mechanism to attempt to resolve that is market forces and the shareholders that have put this resolution up.